This chart summarizes the structure of the world economy and the distribution of its population based on International Comparison Program, ICP, 2011 results. Let's break the chart down to understand exactly how. Gross domestic product, GDP, is the monetary value of all finished goods and services produced within a country. To compare the standard of living across different countries, GDP per capita is more useful. It's calculated by dividing the GDP of a country by its population. This is the GDP per capita of India and Germany, but these bars are not comparable because they're expressed in different currencies, Indian rupee and German euro. In order to compare them, they need to be converted into the same currency. So let's convert them into the US dollar. Do we use the exchange rates? Actually, exchange rates do not reflect the prices of non-tradable goods and thus cannot accurately measure the relative purchasing power of a currency in its national market. Also, they can be influenced by speculation, interest rates, government intervention, and capital flows between economies. To compare the real size of world economies, purchasing power parities, PPPs, are the better measure because they're both currency converters and spatial price deflators. In other words, they're conversion rates that both convert to a common currency and equalize the purchasing power of different currencies. Now we can convert the GDP per capita of each country in real terms. Let's add Brazil. The bar heights express the GDP per capita of each country. Let's place the highest GDP per capita on the right and lowest on the left. India's population is about 1.2 billion. Multiplying the population by India's real GDP per capita gives its total GDP in real terms. Same for Brazil and for Germany. Including total GDPs of all countries shows the real GDP of the world economy. The x-axis expresses the accumulated world population and the country shares in the total world population. Now for each bar, the height expresses the real GDP per capita. The width is the share of population of each country, and the area of the bar is the real GDP of the country. The line for the world average GDP per capita in real terms is 13,460 US dollars. It hits the bar at around 72%, which means about 72% of people live in countries whose average GDP per capita is below the average for the world. About 28% live above. Analyzing the distribution of the world's real GDP and accumulated population using this chart enables better understanding and analysis of the structure of the world economy. We look forward to sharing more videos on ICP 2011 results in the near future.